Hi, welcome to my total body workout today. Um, I'm going to be using lightweight dumbbells with the workout. So if you have them, feel free to use them. If you don't just do the workout without them. Um, I have a set of seven pound and four pound dumbbells. I'll probably be, be going back and forth between the two, depending on the exercise and how I'm feeling. Um, if any point you're feeling something like it hurt or you did something wrong, please stop and put the weights down. Um, so we're going to begin with a 30 second plank and 10 V ups. So we're going to do this round for three times. We're going to do this round three times. I'm going to get my timer here near me so that I can see how we're doing. So everybody get into plank position on your forearms and on your toes. And let's begin 30 second plank. So bring your head over your hands, make sure your back is nice and flat and your core is engaged. From here, we're gonna be going into V-sits. So full V-sits for 10. And this is not as fast as we can go. This is just doing things safely and efficiently. Focus on your breath. We're almost there for five more seconds. 30 seconds, we're just kind of warming up our core, getting ready to activate. And here we go. So now we're gonna go into our V-sits, extending the legs out all the way. My arms go overhead. On the exhale breath, sit and down. Exhale and down. Two to go, nine, 10. Back to our planks. If you cannot do, let's go, we're on 30 seconds. The V-sits, feel free to do a modified V-sit. I'll show you the modified version next. Hold this for 30 seconds. Again, we're warming up our core, getting ready for our workout. Almost there, five seconds. And rest. On to our V-sits, modified version. Still coming up all the way, bringing your knees in bent instead of straight up in the air. Halfway. Three, two, one. On to plank for one more set here. 30 seconds, we're on. Hands apart, hips are down, back is flat, and we're breathing. Halfway there, and then one more round of the V-sits. So just a nice little warm up here for our core. Almost there, three, two, and one. One more set of V-sits. Here we go. Arms are up overhead, inhale, and down. Pick which one, I'm doing both. Three to go, three, two, one. Excellent job. Moving on to our first circuit. We're gonna just move first without weights, just again, warming up our body. We're gonna go into air squats. We have 10 air squats, 10 push-ups, five burpees. So bear with me with my breathing. We're working hard. Let's go. 10, 9, 8, 7, push through the heels, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. 10 push-ups, plank position. 
nine, eight, six, five, four, three, two, one. Burpees, five here. Two. Three, four, five. All right, second round, squats. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, one. 10 push ups. Head over hands. Last one. And burpees. Aren't these fun? <laughs> Are not my favorite, which probably means that I should do more of them. Two, three, four, five. Very good. Back to our squats. Last round of this first circuit. Squats for 10. Seven, six, five, four, three, and push-ups. Modified would be on our knees. Now, I'm gonna show you the modified for this last round for 10. Make sure when you're doing your knee push-ups, if you are, that your hips are moving with you. For 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, and one. Modified burpee, we go down, step back, push up, step up, and over, down, step back, push up, step up, and over, two, three, you got it. Great job with that first circuit. Go ahead and grab a drink of water and I'll be right back for our second circuit. Okay, next circuit, we're gonna be on the ground. So you can lie down on your back we're gonna be doing bridge with chest flies with our dumbbells, tricep dips, actually tricep extensions, excuse me, and squats with weights. So we'll start with our bridges with the chest fly. So we're lying down. For this one, I'm gonna use the seven pound weights and I'm gonna be down here on the ground. Our chest fly happens when we're in our bridge, open and close and down. So we bridge and lift, we open, close and down. Weights are in front of your body, in front of your shoulders and over your chest. You open wide, squeeze together and then return the hips and the, and the arms at the same time. Good, that's four. We have 10. Five and down. Lift, open. Six. Seven. Eight, nine, and 10, and lower. Lower the weights down, come on up. 
for tricep extensions and then squats with our weights. Again, I'm gonna use these seven pound dumbbells. I'm gonna get into a hinged position with my back flat, my arms are in front. Chest lifted, I'm gonna pull my arms back into a row and then I'm gonna straighten the arms and bend for 10. Nine, eight, my arms are so close to my body. Six, five, four, elbows are still. Two and one. Next, we'll do our squat with weights. Feet shoulder width apart. Abs are tight. We squat and stand for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5. Keep it going. 4, 3, 2, and 1. Very good. Back onto the ground. Our bridges and chest flies. So here's chest center, lift, arms lift, open and close for 10. And lower, lift, and lower. Remember, arms in front of you. You got this. Squeeze the glutes as you lift. Halfway there, four, Lift. Two. One. And we're down. Good. Coming back up. Tricep extensions. Again, arms are back and close to the body. Press and squeeze the back of the arm for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, and one, great job. We've got one more to go here. Lift, open, close, and lower. Lift, two, three, four, Almost there, two to go. Very good. Last round for tricep extensions. Here we go, elbows back and close. Two, three, four, five, six, eight, nine, ten. Great job. Squats with weights for ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Great job. And one more round of squats because I forgot the squats on the second round. So here we go for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Great job. All right, so let's see. For our next circuit, we are gonna do lunges with our bicep curls, lunges with lateral raises, and deadlift with a row. So our first, we'll go on the right side lunge. I'm gonna grab again the seven pound dumbbells for this exercise. I'm gonna go my right leg forward, my left leg back, and then I'll switch for the other exercise. So a lunge with a bicep curl for 10. We're gonna squat to our lunge, curl, and stand. That's one, two. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Switching legs. I'm also going to drop weight here. Switching legs, left foot forward, down and out for lateral raises for ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five. My arms only come to my shoulders. Four. Three, two, one. Back to my heavier weights for the deadlift with row. When you do a deadlift, just be very mindful of your center, focusing on your core when you lift. So my feet are slightly apart here. I'm gonna hinge forward my back flat. My knees are soft, but I'm not bending through the knee. Hinging over, I'm gonna hold. I'm gonna row 
and then I'm going to stand tall. Hinge over, row, and stand tall. That's two, three. When you do a deadlift, you want to feel that stretch behind the ham back of the leg and the hamstrings, tight through the core. The row, you're going to feel your upper back pinching. About three more here. And lift. And lift. Last one. And lift. Great job. Back to our lunges with bicep curl. Right leg forward. And 10. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5 to go. My arms are glued by my sides. My wrists are straight. 2, 1. Switching here and switching the legs. Left foot forward, right leg back for 10 lateral raises. 9, 8, 6, 4, three, two, and one. Deadlifts with a row. Feel free to use a heavier weight if you have it. Halfway here. Three, two, and one. Lunges, last round. Right leg forward, left leg back. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Lightweight, left leg, lateral shoulders. Two, three, six. Last one here. Excellent. One more set of deadlifts, and we're moving along. We're almost done. Here we go. Hinge, row, and stand. Hinge, row, stand. Flat back, tight core. Four, five, halfway. Nine, ten. Excellent job. Take a little break. All right, last round we're gonna do. Um, we're gonna do some squats with an overhead press, some more push-ups and some mountain climbers, and then we'll stretch the end. So we're, I'm gonna grab my four pounds for this one for my overhead press. Feel free to use the sevens. Um, I just have a little shoulder problems. So here we go, squat and overhead press. Try to keep your arms at about 90 degrees when you go down and then just push straight up overhead. Two, three, four, five, halfway there, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, push-ups, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one hold for climbers. Here we go. 10, 9, 10, 7, 6, 5, 3, 2, 1. And we're up again. Great job. Notice I'm doing my mountain climbers slowly, really focusing on core here. Our heart rate's already going up because the arms are going overhead. One, two, three. Eight, nine, ten. Modified push-ups, always welcome. 
10. Three, two, one. Up for plank for mountain climbers. Very good. Last round. We got this. Down and up for 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, four, three, two, and one. One more round of push-ups. Four, three. Oh, all right, mountain climbers. And we made it. Great job with those circuits today. Let's do some stretches. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and start my right arm over for a nice tricep extension. Stretch, tricep stretch here. And other side. That felt good. Be sore tomorrow. And so I'm going to take that shoulder across the front. And switch sides. Let's go ahead and bring our right leg out in front of us. And we're down on our knee. And I'm going to bend into my right leg, stretching out the hip behind, my left hip. I'm gonna come back and stretch my hamstring on my right foot. And switching out the legs. And hinging forward. And coming on up, oh, stretching up, and exhale. Great job. Thank you for being here.